Hey there YouTube viewers and welcome to episode 33 of Mario Luigi Dream Team. In the previous part, we went on through the mountains, we learned to do spin jump. Along with the hover jump in the dream world, we freed some pillows and got some extra attack pieces. So it's back to the main track, because the backtracking in this area I'll do just a bit later. Probably after we got the second ability of this area, which we should get soon, I think at least. So let's see. Where are the guys? Cutlets, this way. Wow. That's a large climb. All the way to the top. But first, let's take this one down. Oh, 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 oh. Look at this, look at this. Before, I'm gonna take this one down. And this one has to live, so. Hopefully, it'll live. Probably not. Ah, damn it, he's gone. Uh, at least I got a new item, which are you know, the DOB boots, which is obviously the date of birth boots, similar to the date of birth hammer. The enemy in the background was one I wanted to battle with. Hopefully, we'll get it later on. Anywho, Luigi is now level 18. Plus 6 on HP. Look at that, 107 HP. That's a lot. But what? Oh, defense. Definitely defense. There we go. Plus 5. Some extra resistance can't really hurt. Basically, the enemy in the background is a strong one and you can lure it with a taunt ball, but sadly we didn't get it this battle. Hopefully I can show you in a later battle that we can actually battle him, but be warned, he really isn't easy, what it was in the background. Anywho, let's continue our ascent on the mountains with the spin here. Well, maybe this one. If it happens, I'll just cut to it. Nope, he didn't appear. Gosh dang, I really wanted him to appear. But anyway, we'll take attack phase number 6 for the area right now, with only 4 remaining. And let's see. We... Might as well go up here. Now you can actually go a few ways, I'm gonna start with the left way. First I'll have to get this. Which is just a super candy. And as for this one, I might as well just immediately drop it, because you cannot reach it like that. One, okay, let's jump up, jump up yet again, now we have to land to the other one, which is, oh man, I fell, dang it, that wasn't what I wanted, I don't even want to get caught in this tornado, to be quite honest, it's really tricky to do, there we go, and then we can just go up here, and let's take a nap in the dream world yet again. Alright, we're back in here. Yeah, and this is one of those three areas. Which you couldn't clear if you didn't do the others, I believe. Not 100% sure about that. Now, actually, no, I'm starting to doubt that. It's not one of the areas. I was mistaken. Because this is a little bit different. Watch out for the things in the background. They can hit you really hard. And the 100 coins can go screw themselves. I'm not really planning to get those. And one more, there we go. That's number 20, I believe. Beetle Fox save 20. We're out of the area, yet again. Okay, now Luigi, wake up. There we go. You freed me. Thank you. You're welcome. Let's go on. <laughs> Nothing more to be said. Let's go all the way to the top. Drop here. I... No. I want to get this. Now I can just jump and get that and jump yet again to get this. There we go. There isn't really a lot more to explore, so might as well just go here and now we can go the other side. Which means we just wait, we wait, launch up, launch up, and there we go. Now you can go to the right, but I recommend going to the left instead. And we get a new enemy, which attacks us for some reason. It causes Mario to trip. Well, that was bad. 
Oh, they're happy when they attack you. Basically, they just attack you like that. They're called Grumbles. And I wanted to do dodge to no hit on that one, but unfortunately Mario tripped, so I didn't really have a choice there. Let's just keep going. Now, if there's only one remaining, he's gonna do a different kind of attack. If you do a double spin, he'll just go straight at you. If he does a single spin, he's gonna trick you. Keep that in mind. While you're battling these enemies. I got fooled by them many times. Many, many times. Luckily, I got dodged down this area already, because if not, I could have been screwed over by that. But I'll get to know it later. It's no biggie. Alright. Now, as for up here, the first thing we're gonna do is pick up a, uh, a shot from Mount Pajamaja for the wakeboard area. But as for here, we cannot really go up here. So, we don't even have a choice. We cannot go up here either, which might be stuff we need to do later, but for now, that's where we go. It's best part of tour. Time to test courage. On Cleef. <laughs> How is it, Large Bow? You have fierce sweat, but if inner beef is tall, it's no problem. Da, Large Bow? Da, Small Bow. Small Bow will show true muscle now in the colors. Watch, watch with eyes. Uh, is right of Large Bow to take Glorious first plunge, da? Duh, maybe Kala should jump, but we strapped the back like bacon wrap. They're both scared. Large bro likes beef. Large bro is side salad. Side salad? I show you side salad. Cannon beef! Wow. Whoa. Large bro! We have to. Luigi, let's go. We have to. Let's go! I believe it's actually possible to get some things in here. Or just fall like that. You can move left and right, but there isn't really a lot to do, so... We're just gonna land there. Now we have to get out of the ground. Come on, there we go. You survive! You're having big muscle, but are you having big, having brain muscle to escape? We give you a hint. Look at Valve. Valve can be turned like grill meat. It's all of hint, flex brain now. Body and brain, both must be beef. If you do not solve, we leave you. Da, but you do solve, massive bros, know it. Large bro, my legs have large pain. Shh, salty tears tenderize through beef. Okay, now as for this one, just do a spin jump near the valve. Oh, it calls the valve to turn, valve to turn, and then we can just escape. There we go. And now that that's activated, we can just go there. And now it's walking downward. I believe you can actually walk the middle road. But that's where we came from, so that's not what we're gonna do. Instead, we're just gonna walk this way. Grab ourselves 10 coins, and then move to the middle. Where we can open the big gate, most likely. Because we'll just walk this way. If you press this, you are able to walk back up. At a much, e much easier rate. And now for this. Oh, the massive bros are off again. Whatever. That's the second mega pillow. We can open the gate if we save him. Mario Luigi, do your best. Luigi, take a good nap. Let's go. Yet again, into another dream world. There's a lot of dream, uh, a lot of pillows to save in this area, so we're gonna run into more dream worlds later on. But that's for later. Alright, now for this one. I believe that this one is not too large, but it's something. Oh, it's this one! It's the one with the tricks. Because the gates will close upon us. And upon doing so, a block will appear. Now we have a time session here going on. Just hit the block. That's going to be shown as fast as you can. So the first one's over there, to number five. Number four. Number three, number two, and all the way up there, number one. There we go. That was a little bit scary in terms of time, but you'll be fine. And now it's open, we can advance onward. We're gonna have more of these in a moment, so keep that in mind. Okay, five more coins, and... Some extra coins for Mario. There we 
we go. No, Luigi. Why'd you do this? What's this? Another five coins. And both one for both of us. And this is gonna be yet another area. Just walk on and you realize that it will be closed down yet again. Boom. Now this one is a bit faster paced and he's gonna trick you a few times, so keep this in mind. You'll see, you'll see in a moment what I mean with this. Like, right now there's only one. But you'll see right, right now he's gonna trick you. You gotta remember this is number three that we're gonna go for, so that's the one over there. Number two is all the way at the top, Jesus. And number one is to the left. There. Still a little bit tricky, but still doable. It's not that you have to stress or something, just... It might, it might cost you a few moments. It's not the easiest thing to do. So let's just go down, and there it is, the second of the Mega Pillows. We'll see some interesting effects once we've rescued this one. It's the number 21 that we've rescued. After this area, I'm definitely going to go and pick up some rewards from the old guy, but that's for later. We're not going to do that right yet, right yet, because it's kind of a waste to go back there. There we go. And... Poof! Big guy. Oh boy, good I'm alive again. Thank you so much for saving me. Great, we revived both Mega Pillows. Ah, Mega Phil! Whoa, Mega Louie, it's been a while. Mega Louie, are you aware of what is going on? Dreamer and his friends need to pass the gate. Oh, is that a fact? If that is so, should we do the thing? We should, Mega Louie, we should do the thing. What thing? Mega, Mega Phil. Mega Lowy Lowy, Mega Mega Phil Lowy. What the fuck? Boom! Straight through the gate. Oh, so I guess they do not open it, just completely trash it. Okay. Someone opened the gate. Gate that lots of massive muscles? You must be Muscle Lords? Not me, I know, no. Muscle Lords of Beast, it's light gold to meet you. I told you we're not. Muscle Lords is great owners like Meaty Dream. You don't listen, huh? Ahem. <clears throat> Gate is open now, so we extend tour. There's unknown past here, no one knows land. Tour now separates meat from potatoes. Now we go, you follow. Well, that's gonna be interesting. So, I'll conclude things here. Thank you guys for watching, stay tuned for episode 34 of Mario Luigi Dream Team. We're gonna explore into the unknown of Mount Pajamaja. See you guys next time.